Hey folks, it's Super Drew here, and I'm going to do some more paintings today. Now you can see in the back I've got some uh, some of the rolls that I just rolled up. These are from the the hunt on December 17th, and I ran out of the uh, wrappers, so I have a few left I have to roll. But I've got 30 rolls here left to do. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, five, five. 30 rolls left to do. So I'm going to dive in and do a well, maybe 20 or 25. We'll see what happens. Maybe I'll do them all. Okay, stand by. Hey folks, I'm back. Um, right now I'm watching it is a shiny Fisherman thing. Juice 22. You might notice though, too. I mean, if you look He's uh, found a 1945 Washington Quarter. Going and he was doing there. a little bit of cleanup on I did something it. In but look at what I just noticed. So this is roll number two. Got and I saw this wheat penny sticking out. And I thought, I'll grab the camera and shoot the video. And as I was moving, um, Look what else I noticed. If it's not like correct, there's another wheat penny. The surface. This is roll number two, and I've got two wheat pennies. There's All right, hold on a second. Let me uh, uh, let me go ahead and hit pause on this video it. here, and let me pull these out of here. Let me uh, make sure there aren't any more. Now it looks like just those two. All right, let's check these dates. Nineteen fifty-eight D and a fifty-six. Well, all right. Okay, folks, stand by. I'm gonna keep going. Okay, guys, I'm back with a quick update. I'm watching Grave Digger Max. Is uh, December 17th, 14 karat gold ring. All right, I'm about, uh, what, two thirds through this really long video. Congratulations, Max, you broke 30 minutes, pal. <laughs> okay, so uh, this is roll number eight. And I didn't see it when I broke open the roll, but I just came across it just now. Okay, hold on a second, let's flip it over. Check the year. Nineteen fifty six D. All right, so I'll put it over here with the coins that I've set aside for the uh, for the wrap up. Okay, stand by, folks. I'll be right back. Hey, folks. I am back, and I've got uh, fifteen rolls done so far, and I'm going to call it at this because I've got some errands to run. So we're going to worry about the other 15 rolls maybe later today or tomorrow. So I went ahead and printed out a grid using my Word Perfect. See I have all my dates printed out now. That'll make it easier for me and quicker. Okay so let's see what we have here. Um, a selection from the 60s. The only thing I did not get was a 67. I did get two 1966ers. Okay here are the 70s. And there are seven 1976ers. Okay, there are the 80s. And the 90s. And the 2000s. So this time, the uh, 75, 82, 1990, 94, 8 and 9, and let's call it 2006. Those guys came through the strongest. Now for the shield backs. 2010, 11, 12, and 13. Look at this. 2013. Got, that's the most I got out of one single year. 
I did get three of the 2009 pennies. And let's just check the back. They're all log cabin. No. Looks like uh, two log cabin and, oh shoot, I don't know what you call this one. Get the capital? I don't know. So I got those three. I've got six that are just beyond belief. One of them is a 1996, but the rest I can't tell. Those will go back. Now for the interesting coins. I've got a 2012 with a nice interesting tone to it. If you look at his coat and above the Liberty, it's kind of a rainbow tone. Next we have a 74S. We've got a really ugly looking 59. Uh, another 59. And now for the wheat pennies. 1956, 1956D, and 1958D. Okay, that's it for this uh, coin roll hunt. Um, like I said, I have 15 rolls left. I'll try to do them later today, but it's probably going to be tomorrow. Okay, folks, I hope everybody has a great day out there. This is Super Drew, signing off.